Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part two of our little jubilee anniversary... Yeah, anniversary is not really right. Our our 50th episode of Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Complete Edition. We are back at the Eden Free area where we are probably about to face off with Kentaurasmon. Wow, it's Kentaurasmon of the Royal Knights. He's so strong, so cool. I already forgot which Digimon type Kentaurasmon was. Was he a vaccine? Was he a data type? Nobody here. I'll suspect he is a vaccine type, so I'll swap my Digimon around for a bit. And hope it'll be enough, because our virus lineup is... Arguably the weakest thing we have. Okay, Ken Taurasmon, what was his voice? I think a bit a low variant of the All Might voice. Worthless human! You bothered coming back? That's enough! Now I'm here too! <laughs> <laughs> so you're the helper? Very well. It only makes you more worthy of destruction. You. I heard about you. Going on a crazy rampage and stuff. What's up with that? You're asking why? It is my impulse. I simply want to break things. The overwhelming ill will of humanity in cyberspace has eaten away at me directly. It triggers my impulse. Break, destroy, shatter! Roar! There's something wrong with him, Rina! I want to break things! I want to break things! This impulse is all the human's fault! The nature of humans is to act as they desire. I understand. And so, I obey my impulse! And as in cyberspace, so too is the real world. Foolish humans, your destruction is all I seek! Well, well, what? You're saying it's our fault? If it's your destructive impulses, then you do something! Wow, poor main character. We have been completely overtaken by Rina. She's the main character now. I mean, that's what we get for being mute. See? This is what what happens if a main character can talk. They are in, inequivocally better. You have to take responsibility for your actions, even I know that. Which means... That you know less than me, okay? Ooh, burn. I, I mean self-burn as well, but... <laughs> what did you say? You don't understand the first thing about us. So a little beating and a lot of talking, okay? 
私を止められるものなく止めてみよう I feel so jealous. She even has a shadow boxing animation. Why can't our, our main character do that? You obnoxious little brat. If you think you can stop me, go ahead and try. Baby, come on, go for it. Part two. Okay, here I go, Hecto. Can we even reach him? Oh, we're we're all flying. Ouch. He was vaccine. What what I, I even said he was vaccine. Why did I Why did I pick my virus Digimon? I think I just had a brain fart. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Ah, anyways, at least one of the Digimon tanked. Uh, tanked, uh, whatever that was. Mm. The Bifrost attack. Ah, yes. I was told in the comments that Kentaro's Mon is inspired and actually named after in Japanese from Sleipnir, Odin's steed. That's why he has a lot of Norse mythology inspired attacks. Interesting, because I, as I said in the answer to that comment, I still maintain that I think its, it's color scheme is very... Chinese Dynasty Warriors E. Okay, Hippogriffmon is sleeping, but Talmon will probably be our main DPS here. So. Oh. Ah, okay, Kentaurusmon gets a lot of turns because it's so fast, but as a trade off, it doesn't have that much HP. Okay, Pixiemon. Please do a sleep recovery on Hippogriffmon. And a speed break against us. Oh, that's unfair. One allies. I still don't have those field charges, and on one ally, those make no sense whatsoever. Hmm. Sonic Void? Yeah, probably. Okay, Piximon, what do you have? Critical charge? Let's do that. Piximon won't do any damage anyway, so... And he has mental charge, okay. Piximon will probably be our medic here. Do I have... yeah, multi-recovery, abnormal statuses. But wait, does it remove positive abnorm abnormal statuses as well? We only have one of the DXs. I'll, should pro I should probably keep that one for the final boss. Hmm. Great! I didn't even notice we're actually flying on all four Vidramon in the background. Yeah, gold main character. That's the that's the main character energy I'm looking for. Nice. That that's actually pretty awesome. But all four Vidramon isn't actually fighting with us. It's just transporting me. Okay. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, and the multi-recovery did not get rid of status effects. Okay. What is this? Hmm. I mean... What can I do? Yeah, I mean, I could do Sonic Void, but... Having Talmon deal reliable there is probably better. Not here. What is that supposed to mean? Interesting, okay. Yeah, crits. Okay, no. Do a Sonic Void for once? Yeah, it does basically nothing. Okay, Piximon, you do a health capsule. Ouch. Again with the mental break fields. But still, I, I am actually kind of uh, quite enjoying this fight here because, I mean, it is complex. He's actually pursuing a strategy against us, which is great. I mean, when can you ever say that? That gets oh no it can take four status effects I, I thought it would maybe get rid of the of the down down effect so yeah that's actually pretty great the only other time where we had an actual strategy was with with the alien type Digimon in in the memories and way in, in the beginning of the game with what even was it Wisemon I think where were the the mm, gardener slash manga authoress was corrupted by a Digimon that was also a tough fight okay Piximon yeah you may die so let's just swap you two out for now because Ken Taldos Mon is about to do a triple here. I hope Talmon will survive that. Odin's breath. Ouch. Okay, that should be it. No, it isn't. Or is it? Okay. Yeah, cutscene time. Show everyone why we are the main character and not Rina. Victory is ours! We did it, Hecto! How do you feel now? Cooler heads raining? <laughs> but but other Alphos Vidramon didn't even do anything. Uh Impossible to be able to keep up with my speed. Uh, go on then, do it quickly. Finish me off. <laughs> Finish you? W what do you mean? No one's finishing anyone. 
You intend to show mercy? Listen, you've got it all wrong. Didn't I tell you? We've got some long talking to do. So. Come travel with me for a little while. Weevee and I will be staying in this world a little while longer. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. We are. We have become obsolete. <laughs> Go somewhere with a human? Me? What rubbish! She's taught no jutsuing him. Quick can Taurasmon escape or be converted? Well, it seems like you've only ever seen the bad side of humans. You can't think we're all like that. So a little time with us will clear up your little misunderstanding. If it is indeed a misunderstanding, that is. And if there's no good to be found here in this world, then come to ours! We'd welcome you! I mean, great, great idea! <laughs> in any case, he is no longer my problem after this. <laughs> <laughs> You're thinking I'd go along with that plan? Why not? Yeah, he. Yep! Hmm, alright. I'll go along with that plan, even though I s just said I wouldn't. I'll go along for the sake of your optimism. And if we should find no good among humans, then... Okay, let's do some sightseeing. Where to begin? Anything good to eat? Hey, don't interrupt. That's rude. We're leaving! Ah, oh, wait up, Rina! Okay, if you need our power, call us whenever! And off they go! What the? So then Kentarosmon isn't our ally? Yeah. Kentarosmon probably didn't even notice we were here. Well, whatever. I better get back to the agency. Good on you, Hector, main character Kuhn. Don't let this get you down. You're still the main character in our hearts. I see. Kentaro's mom must have been confused. He's just running around and isn't causing any damage. Maybe he's trying to clear his head. But as for that, Rina Shinomiya... No, I have no questions to ask about her. I know everything already. In any event, all Force Vidramon has unparalleled fighting power. We must thank Mirei Mikagura. That's it. I'll develop a new blend for her. Who knows, she's weird enough, maybe maybe she'll be into that. Why are you looking so mad? 
Are you thinking she won't get my coffee? It's been a secret up until now, but she understands my creative energies, and in fact, she helps me focus them. And the truth comes out at long last. Kyoko has been cheating all along and got all her crazy info and intel from the narrator herself. That's no good, Kyoko. One of my four masterpieces was her idea. The Bonito Broth and Balsamic Vinegar Blend. I had no idea. Mire Nakagura, a fearsome individual. We got a thousand CSP! Our Royal Knights allies are coming along well. But Leopardmon must be aware of our actions. Don't let your guard down, sweetie. Before we take the call from Date, Let's think about that. Who's already on our team? We have Jasmon, we have Alphus Vidramon and Kentaurasmon, we have Omegamon, and who else? I am sure I forgot some people. Yeah, the the Guilmon, the Guilmon Digivolution, Ga Guilmon Digivolution, the one with the big shield. I forgot its name. That's five. Who else is there? Because I think there was 12 Royal Knights. Now 13 with Jasmon, but minus one for his instructor. Because I think that one retired. So it's back to 12. Yeah. So we'll probably recruit one more if I am not forgetting anyone. How rare! A call from Date! Hey, detective! One of those monsters has shown up in Asakusa! We don't have the man to deal with this! Go on and check it out for me! Thanks! Ada? Was that supposed to be a case request? It's like I'm the only handyman in town around here. This makes it vague when it comes to the contract. It's a problem, but there's nothing to be done. That monster. If an eater has appeared, then maybe conditions have changed. I should charge double now. Okay, it's your turn. The location is Asakusa. Head over there ASAP. Will do, roger that, boss. And with that, our 50th episode comes to a close. Yeah, that was fun, we took a trip to the parallel world and it has become a way bigger deal than I ever could have imagined. Seems to be a main part of the plot now, that we can just go to parallel worlds and get stuff. Okay. I hope we'll finish out the recruiting phase of our little Royal Knights adventure in the next episode, and I hope I'll see you ladies and gents over there. Until next time, I guess.